And I, you know, on some real shit, I don't even want to talk about that old fucking butthead. Like, cause at the, at some point, he got to grow the fuck up. You see what I'm saying? Because Boosie, he too old to be doing the shit he be doing. G, like on two the week, I, motherfuckers respect you. You an OG. You want you on the, the OGs of this shit. Yeah, uh, and, 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 yeah. and 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 you got to it, it, it's just not. But he it's, be it's, it's, crazy it's, on the it's, internet. And it's, it, it, it's you play crazy with your your daughter, and it's it's the same, folks. You do a lot of shit that a father shouldn't do with their kids, man, and. You got you got a nurse to be po- poking your nose and something that's going on in the right. All I asked you to do was respect my homie name when you speak on duck name and how you spoke on folks shit. I mean that's any real like human being. This this human being the human being like and I said it nice as here. I say man, you as a public figure, some some shit you you can't say. I say it might hurt a motherfucker feeling. Somebody could take that shit wrong. You see what I'm saying? And then he go around, he turn around after he did speak to me. I said, damn, I wish I, I was there tonight, Vaughn, that he hit me up there. Now you want to come out fucking three years, then, what, two and a half years? He said, he said that. And I said, Vaughn, hit him up, hit you up, the the come up to the, the come up that other night. It's crazy. And it's like, motherfucker, no, I ain't say nothing wrong about yeah. what I said. All I said was, he like, yeah, that boy FBG Duff. So as I heard that shit, I knew his ass was going to die. What the what what the fuck you mean? No. What about what about his family? What about his kids and shit? And when they type his name in, and you gonna still pop up as one of the hip hop legends, right? And they gonna be like, damn, that's why why would he say that? Same like you ain't real, boost. Now nah, motherfucker gotta really think about what's going on. Mm. You can't never talk about motherfucking shit. Your your son, your son, let it be known that your ass is a rat. When y'all got into it, your daughter always t- you ain't even like that for real, boy. Your daughter tell you, your son, when you and your son got into it on live, what he tell you? He bust stop playing because you know I know some shit. He gonna want to fight, boy. <laughs> did he Did he not? What did little Tootie say, gang? What did the Tootie say on live? He say, they was going back and forth. He say, he say, boy, you know I'm like that. He say, yo, he say, you, your ass ain't like that, boy. You know I know some shit. You don't want me to get to talking. Cause his son know your, your son know your ass a rat. You a fucking gangster rat. Oh, folks, grave. You can't never come for me, bro. And said I told him because I told him I spoke on dead people. You played with my homie first, then you turned around and let a motherfucker geek you up to tweak with me, right? I would knock your old ass out. Oh, suck damn Gregory, folks. I would knock you the fuck out, bro. I would beat your old ass, G. I would beat the fuck out your old ass, G. Oh, my dead brother, folks. Oh, my sister Gray, I would beat the fuck out of him, bro. Because in real life, you plenty. <laughs> All the motherfuckers asked you to do was respect the idea. But see, the internet paid me too. So I, I, I understand how, how it get when motherfuckers be off that shit. You used to, you used to play with your nose and shit. Damn. But fuck, we can't. I can't argue with a dope fiend. Oh, fuck, Gray. <laughs> You might be strong as hell. <laughs> Playing with that. that. No, seriously, though. Like, game. Chill. All the motherfuckers told you to do is watch how you speak on our big homie name. You, I say, game, you a fucking public figure. Yeah. Ain't no way in here you supposed to say what you said about Duck. You don't even know us. It's a lot of It'd shit. It'd have been different if you was on some gangster shit. Like, yeah, I was, I was, I was watching Shorty. Uh, I was going to snatch him up. But then I heard that it was ways around what you said. You was just on that bitch just popping your shit. And you let a motherfucker throw that Chicago shit under you. Right? You was a bitch. On first grade. Now, now, oh damn, I wish I would have made it to the thing for Vaughn. I probably could have stopped it from happening. Why the fuck you ain't been say that shit? Why the fuck it take you, what, two and a half, almost three years to, to come out and say some shit like that? After you get into it with a motherfucker. And technically, we ain't into it. We just, at this point, we just exchanging words. And to the point of, when I catch you, I'm going to knock your old ass out. Oh, bro. If you won't slide, motherfucker, then slide. <laughs> but I was telling my boy, uh, when, I, when, I, when I first 
saw him made that song about all those people, I was like, man, they gonna, they gonna try to get dude, bro. Like, I said it, bro, I mean, I ain't gonna lie, I said it, I said it to my boy K, I was like, man, I don't know, <laughs> like, you know, like, cause I know if, if somebody would've did that in my city in Baton Rouge, it was over for him. It was over for him because it's, so many people could be wanting your head. And then once you blowing up, like I said, they want to, they want to take down that motherfucker blowing up. They want to get you before you get on that, on top of that mountain. You know, so I ain't feel good for his safety when I heard that song. You know? Yeah, Hell, How do you no, man. I ain't gonna lie, and I really feel like Boosie shouldn't even speak on shit that don't concern they, they city or they war, cause you know Boosie was in a war. Boosie went through his own trauma, you know what I'm saying? And like, granted, he's here. You know, I I really feel like when it came to the Ducks head situation, yeah, it was a big thing. You know, uh, a Chicago legend died. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He was one of the ones who started the drill slam. You know? Yeah. So it's like, so you don't feel like that was the final straw? I mean, I, hell nah, man. Um, bro, like, I feel like Teezy. Chash in the lag and now look, everybody life is gone. I don't took a, a built up based off a lie. Cause his phone calls and text messages to everybody was duck right here with four and four switches trying to kill me. Right? Was duck right there with four? Did duck have four switches? No. No. Huh? No. Nah. No bull. If that call was, that was a panic attack. That was a 911. Right? They said that he was jealous because Duck was fing like he's one of his best. He's fing mom, the same bitch that took the stand on him. Yeah. The same bitch that, 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 that received the cash out receipt for him dropping the low, the on, 5K. On the stand, did she admit that she was having sexual relationships with Duck? She said they was together in high school. Mm. She ain't said they was together 